The Magical Congress of the United States of America, or better known as MACUSA, is the American equivalent of the Ministry of Magic and was created in 1693. At the time of its creation, Wizard Nomad's relations were at an all-time low, Nomad being the equivalent of a muggle. The recent Salem witch trials had the Wizards and Witches of America in a severe level of discomfort and many felt that creating an underground community could result in living freer and happier lives. This suggestion was supported by magical communities all over the world. Today, Makusa is the equivalent of the Ministry of Magic, but it was actually modelled on the Wizards Council of Great Britain, the governing body that eventually became the Ministry. Representatives from magical communities all over North America were elected to positions to help create laws and policies to protect the American wizard kind. While creating these new laws, Makusa had a primary aim, and that was to rid the continent of scourers, wizards who hunted their fellow magical beings for personal gain. The magical body's secondary aim was stopping the number of wizarding criminals who had fled to America as their own country's laws were policed to the highest degree. The first president of Makusa was Josiah Jackson, a strong wizard with a tough heart and nature. Many believed he had the capabilities of dealing with the difficulties of the post-Salem witch trials era. His immediate priority was to recruit and train aurors. Since there were so few aurors and the congress so new, these wizards knew they would be required to lay down their lives. There were 12 aurors that Jackson picked and these people were given particular respect in the US ever since. I will list the original 12 Aurors names in the description of this video as currently there are no pictures available of these people. There are many challenges for Makusa to overcome, the biggest challenge being that there was no relations between the Nomaj government and Makusa itself. One of the challenges it did overcome however was creating the magical law to enforce total segregation of the wizarding and Nomaj communities. The segregation was so strict that it was actually illegal for magic and non-magic people to marry. Furthermore, even friendships between the two communities became illegal by 1790. This was known as Rapport's Law, named after Emily Rapport, the then president. Like the Ministry of Magic, the Department of Magical Law Enforcement is the largest department in Makusa, and by the 1920s, Rapport's Law was still in operation. In addition to these harsh laws, wizarding criminals suffered a more serious penalty in America, where in Britain, criminals will be sent to Azkaban for their crimes. In America, they will be executed. Thank you very much for watching today's video everyone, I really hope you enjoyed it. If you did enjoy it, then please make sure to give this video a thumbs up as it helps the video out a great deal and it also helps the channel to grow. Secondly, please continue to leave your video suggestions in the comment section below, I really really enjoy reading them and your choice could be next. Don't forget, if you'd like to subscribe to this channel, all you have to do is click the subscribe button in the description below. And finally, if you want to check out any more videos, you can see in front of you there's two video choices and underneath there's two choices for two playlists for more videos for you to watch. Thank you very much again everyone and don't forget, have a great day.